Hey, what's up everybody? It's the Hyphen here and today I'm going to show you guys how to easily sync all of your external audio files with all of your video files in DaVinci Resolve. You can do this individually, but the faster way to do it is to sync all your files within a bin. Here I have two different video clips and for each video clip I record it two different sources of external audio. A1 and B1 for clip 1, A2 and B2 for clip 2. So whether you're syncing one audio recording or multiple audio recordings, it's really simple. In your bin, which for me is the master bin, don't have any clip selected. Right click, scroll down to auto sync audio. You could choose time code. I'm going to use waveform. Use channel one. I'm going to select to retain embedded audio. I like to do this so that I can make sure that the audio is in fact in sync correctly. It normally is, but on occasion, sometimes it could be a little off. You can choose to retain your video metadata. I'm not. I'm going to click on sync now. And now it's done. So if I grab clip one, put it into my timeline, you can see it kept the original audio from my video file. And here, just based on the size of the waveform, when you compare it up here, you can see that this is B1, and you can see that this one is A1. Now this is awesome, saves a lot of time. And if you want, you can end up deleting the original track from the video, and then just work with however many layers of external recorders that you have. But let's say you don't want that original audio file in there. Right click, auto sync audio, don't check retain embedded audio, sync. And then now when you drag it in, you're only going to see any audio files that do sync with your video file. As I mentioned, I had two different external audio recorders running at the same time, which is why I have two different tracks. But if you only had one, then you would only have one here. Now I do want to give a quick note. When you sync with multiple tracks, as you can see here when I have it selected, they all get selected. If I wanted to normalize the audio, but it's going to bring up the other one as well for the exact same amount of gain. Let me undo. If another audio track is higher, then that track will more than likely be clipping. So if you want to normalize these separately, you're going to have to unlink them. For me, I have a keyboard shortcut, which is L for unlock. And now every layer is separate. So now if you select both of them, but they're not linked, you can normalize. You can right click, go to normalize audio levels. And if you have independent selected, they will individually normalize. So you don't have to worry about one now becoming higher than that level. And then you can just reselect all your clips again if you want to keep them together and relink them so that they move together. So here, if I bring in my second video clip, again, you can see my two different external audio recordings are perfectly synced. Now, if you're wondering why I have two different external recorders running at the same time, that's because this specific video is a beat making video and I have a lavalier mic on me for when I speak. And then I have another mic pointed at the speakers to pick up the audio of the beat making. So when I edit this, I cut back and forth between the dialogue recording and the speaker recording. So there you guys have it. That's how simple it is to auto sync all of your external audio with all of your video easily within a bin in DaVinci Resolve. Now I do have a DaVinci Resolve playlist on this channel with a lot more tutorials. So go ahead and check that out. Hopefully this video helped you. If it did, please drop a like on this video. Drop a comment below if you have any questions and please make sure to subscribe. I have a lot more videos coming soon. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.